Jackson uh, asks us on our Facebook page here, in a general election between Hillary Clinton and Rand Paul, who would have your vote? Ah, uh, it's the age-old question, Jackson. That's what it is. Uh, I still don't know. <laughs> People asked me this like a year ago. I was like, I don't know. I have to think about it. Here I am today. I don't know. Now, to some people, that's a crazy answer. If you actually go issue for issue, it's the furthest thing from a crazy answer. It is the most straightforward and correct answer anybody's ever given on any issue ever. <laughs> so, for Rand Paul, Rand Paul would be better, I think, unquestionably, on foreign policy. Uh, Rand Paul is much more non-interventionist than Hillary fucking Clinton. Hillary's one of the Democrats that doesn't even really try to hide her interventionist hawkish streak. She supported and, and orchestrated the intervention in Libya. Uh, she's in favor of doing even more intervention in Syria. Favor of Iraq was in favor of Afghanistan. Um, you know, she would probably at least continue to do what Obama's done with the drones and the special ops in Pakistan and Yemen and Somalia. Lord knows where else she would get us involved. So... Rand Paul is definitely less hawkish than that. He's not as non-interventionist as his dad is. I tend to agree more with his dad on, on this issue, uh, Ron Paul, but he's definitely less interventionist than Hillary, and he's said some good things on foreign policy, so for foreign policy, the answer is Rand Paul. Um, for drug reform, I think the answer is Rand Paul, too, because he's more committed to at least decriminalizing marijuana, maybe even legalizing marijuana. Hillary seems to pay lip service, doesn't really care every now and then she talks about it. So on social issues and foreign policy, you go Rand Paul. Now, it's a little more complicated because Hillary, for example, is better on abortion. Rand Paul's, I think, more pro-life. Hillary's more pro-choice, but like a moderate kind of pro-choice. And actually, I agree with the moderate version of pro-choice that Hillary Clinton is. Um, on economic policy... It's not close. I actually think Hillary's way better because Hillary would not get rid of the EPA, would not get rid of the FDA, would not eliminate the income tax, would not cut social safety net programs. And even if she did, she wouldn't do it to the extent that Rand Paul would do because he wants to get rid of those fucking things. So on economics, she wins. On foreign policy, he wins. On social issues, it's a little bit of a split. Um, and then you have areas where they both suck like TPP. Hillary pretends she's against it. I don't believe her for a second. She pushed for it 45 times, and at one point she called it the gold standard. Uh, Rand Paul, I believe, is for TPP also. <laughs> so, and they're both, to an extent, bought. I mean, Hillary is kind of an extra level of bought because of her long-ass career and the Clinton Foundation. Um, but Rand is also bought too. So, again, I don't know. Uh, Rand Paul is the one Republican who really makes me stop and think about yeah, I, I, I might vote for that guy. There are conceivable situations and circumstances where I'd go, yeah, I'm voting for Rand Paul. But he's probably the only one of the Republicans that falls into that category. But yeah, it's the age-old question. I still don't have an answer for you, and I'm sorry about that.